Hello everyone, in this video we'll learn a program to print sum of odd and even integers from 1 to 10. So first of all inside the main function, now we have to declare three variable of integer type int i, i is a loop counter variable, e sum is a variable for sum of even number and o sum is a variable for the sum of odd number and both the variables are initialized with 0. Then after that apply the syntax of for loop for i is equal to 1, the initial value of i is 1, then put the condition i is less than equal to 10. So first of all condition is to be evaluated, 1 is less than equal to 10, condition is evaluated to be true, condition is evaluated to be true. Now control transfer to the body of loop. Now body of loop is to be evaluated. Now we have to check i whether it is even or odd. How to check? Put the condition. If i modulus 2 is equal to equal to 0, if this condition is true, that means a given value is a even. Now in this case i is 1, 1 modulus 2 is equal to equal to 0, 1 modulus 2 is 1 modulus 2 is 1. Now 1 is equal to equal to 0, condition is evaluated to be false. That means a 1 is a even number. Then else part is to be evaluated O sum is equal to O sum plus i. O sum is 0, 0 plus 1, 0 plus 1 is 1. Now i plus plus increase the value of i by 1. Now i become 2, 2 is less than equal to 10. Again condition is evaluated to be true. Now check the if condition. If i modulus 2, i is 2. 2 modulus 2 is equal to equal to 0. Now 2 modulus 2 is 0. 0 is equal to equal to 0. Condition is true. Now e sum is equal to e sum plus i. Now e sum is 0. 0 plus 2 is 2. i plus plus i become 3. 3 is less than equal to 10. condition is evaluated to be true. Now check the if condition 3 modulus 2 is equal to equal to 0, 3 modulus 2 is 1, 1 is equal to equal to 0, condition become false. Then else part is to be evaluated O sum is equal to O sum plus i. Now O sum is 1, 1 plus 3 is 4, i plus plus i become 4, 4 is less than equal to 10, condition is true. Now check the divisibility, if condition 4 modulus 2 is equal to equal to 0, 4 modulus 2 is 0, 0 is equal to equal to 0, condition become true. Now e sum is equal to e sum plus i, e sum is 2, 2 plus i, i is 4, 2 plus 4 6 i plus plus i become 5, 5 is less than equal to 10, again condition is true. Then check the divisibility, 5 modulus 2 is equal to equal to 0, 5 modulus 2 is 1, 1 is equal to equal to 0, false. Then else part is to be evaluated, 5 is a even number. Four plus five is nine. I plus plus I become six. Six is less than equal to ten. Again, condition is true. Now check the divisibility. If condition is to be evaluated, six modulus two is equal to equal to zero. Condition is evaluated to be true. Now E sum is equal to E sum plus I. 6 plus 6, 12, 
then i plus plus i becomes 7 7 is less than equal to 10 condition is true then check the divisibility 7 modulus 2 is equal to equal to 0 7 modulus 2 is 1 1 is equal to equal to 0 condition becomes false then else part is to be evaluated o sum is equal to o sum plus i now o sum is 9 9 plus 7 i is 7 9 plus 7 16 i plus plus i become 8 8 is less than equal to 10 again condition is true now check the divisibility with if condition 8 modulus 2 is equal to equal to 0 8 modulus 2 is 0 0 is equal to equal to 0 condition become true now e sum is equal to e sum plus i e sum is 12 12 plus i i is 8 12 plus 8 20 i plus plus i become 9 now 9 is less than equal to 10 again condition is true now check the divisibility of 9 with if condition 9 modulus 2 is equal to equal to 0 9 modulus 2 is 1 1 is equal to equal to 0 condition become false then else part is to be evaluated o sum is equal to o sum plus i o sum is 16 16 plus 9 25 i plus plus i become 10 now 10 is less than equal to 10 condition is evaluated to be true then check the divisibility with the help of if condition 10 modulus 2 is equal to equal to 0 now 10 modulus 2 is 0 0 is equal to equal to 0 condition become true now e sum is equal to e sum plus i e sum is 20 plus i is 10 20 plus 10 30 then i plus plus i become 11 now 11 is less than equal to 10 condition become false then control transfer to the out of loop then with print a function display the sum of even numbers and odd numbers now sum sum of even number is equal to percentage d and write down the name of output variable e sum then printf sum of odd number is equal to percentage d comma the name of output variable o sum now run this code now the sum of even number is 30 and sum of odd number is 25 Thank you.